Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back to Scrap Mechanic Survival Mode. Now, today, we are going to be putting ourselves through another challenge because I'm going to try to go for a high-level warehouse. And by high-level, I mean there's a lot of levels to it. I think the only warehouse that we've successfully completed so far was three levels. And there's definitely different warehouses with different heights, which means more floors that you have to get through. And the reason why I want to do this is because we have like 12 garment boxes that are just common right now. And I want to do another dress bot based episode where we get to unbox a bunch of cool new outfits and see if we can have an actual fully matching outfit at some point. All I need is some yellow pants or just some other awesome stuff that is a completely different color. I'm hoping for, you know, red and black. If we could get some red and black, that'd be great. But um, the last time I got an epic garment box was in a warehouse. I don't know if that's guaranteed, but I figured let's go back to a warehouse and try to make it to the loot stuff. Now, if you missed the last episode where I built this car, which is amazing at taking out all kinds of bots, including the bosses, very, very quickly, then you're going to want to go ahead and check that out in the top right corner. And if you're just joining us for the survival series, then I'll leave a playlist in the description of the entire playthrough in order from beginning up to present. But I've made just a few changes since the last episode. Um, I've actually added some drills to the back wheels because I, w I wanted to add saws like this, but I didn't have enough metal to make more saws. So I uh, the drills actually fit really, really well on the large wheels. So I figured why not use these? It does increase my profile a little bit, which might make it more difficult to navigate through dense areas. But uh, it might be worth it uh, since the hay boss will probably not try to hit this wheel at all. Another thing I did was I added two more loot chests to this. So we used to have just the two up in front, but now I added another layer of loot chests. So now we got four chests on this thing in case we find a lot of loot. I am all stocked up with ammo on that one. And I have some provisions for thirst and hunger for our warehouse journey. And I am carrying 200 ammo on me, as well as some milk and bananas. Really need that calcium and potassium to uh, help get us through the warehouse. So, uh, bosses feel really, really easy now, based off of the different strategies I've, uh, adopted for fighting them. So I think tape bots are now probably the biggest threat to us. Oh, oh, let's do a quick test here. Here. Are you gonna, are you gonna try to attack me? I'm thinking that my vehicle might be mostly, not from the, not from the side, not from the side, no! No, 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 don't hit, don't hit, don't hit, don't hit! Stop! Just stop! Stop! No, he's on top of me! Ah! I thought he was going to take out my seat. That was like the worst possible case scenario of what could have happened with that guy. All right, but um, as long as he's not on top of me, I think we're safe. <laughs> How did that even happen? <laughs> Man. Oh, I'm just noticing, I think... I think the drills make noise when they're on your wheels. That's not our normal driving sound. Huh. Yeah, I think... I think the drills actually make noise when they're spinning, even if they're not spinning on, like, their own bearing. That's kind of interesting. Alright, I don't know if I like it. I don't know if I like having to deal with that noise. Alright, so I'm just gonna drive in this general direction away from my mechanic station, and I'm just gonna look for the biggest warehouse I can. There we go! That right there is what I'm talking about. One, two, three, four at least. And that looks really, really tall, so... Maybe four is the max, and I was just overestimating the five levels. All right, so then uh, let's get to it. And of course, I'm arriving at night, so it's going to be hard to see all the tape bots on the outside. Oh my goodness, I just realized I didn't bring a warehouse key with me. Um, There better be a boss guy here, because I can't believe I actually forgot to bring a warehouse key with me. I am so unprepared right now. I can't believe this. I have like 20-something warehouse keys back home. And I went out to go to a warehouse, and now... Oh, I gotta sleep in the bed. I gotta sleep in my bed at my car. So many... Mis I hear one. Yes, I hear a boss here. We can definitely do this. Thank you. Thank you for actually being a boss at the warehouse. Alright, but where is he? There he is. Oh, he's right there. You know what? I, I, I get a plan right now. We are going to lead him to the car, because the most efficient way to kill him is actually with my car. So you ready for this? Oh, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes! Come on. Come on. Come at me, bro. There 
There we go, just like that. I love this car, man. I love this car. And we got ourselves the warehouse key that we needed. See, I, I planned on this. This was all part of the plan. I just wanted there to be more excitement coming over here, you know? All right, we got our warehouse key. Now, let's get into the warehouse. So I have to be really cautious because if I get hit twice, I'm dead. And it is really dark right now. There's the entrance. What? There we go. All right. I'm, I'm an idiot again. I put the warehouse key in my loot crates because I was just on autopilot. So I got to go back to my car to get the warehouse key to come back and open the gate. Oh no, I'm getting hit, I'm getting hit, I'm getting hit, who's hitting me? Don't hit me again, don't hit me again. I hear him running after me, I don't see him. Okay, I didn't think that going back the same path was gonna be much of a threat. All right, I have the warehouse key with me this time, and oh, there's the tape bot that shot me. I see you behind there. All right, we're good. All right, all good. Nope, not all good. He's right behind here. There we go. Whew! Now let's, uh... Oh. I didn't need the warehouse key. All that stuff about the warehouse key and apparently this is the warehouse that I failed at but my first time going to a warehouse this is the one that I died on the third floor after running out of ammo oh my goodness <laughs> all right we're here though we're here I'm just gonna I'm just gonna ignore all of that annoyance and uh, let's get to this so as far as I know uh, the warehouses are still not lootable as far as uh, disabling some encryptor or whatever so I'm not focusing on that I'm just focusing on getting to the loot room and trying not to die. So let's see if we can pull this off here. Yep, I've definitely been here. You can tell by all this stuff. Wait, does that mean that the tape bots haven't respawned yet? I wonder if, uh, I've never been back to the same warehouse that I completed. I wonder if you loot a warehouse, does it remain looted forever? Or does the, like the epic loot respawn? All right, I'm just gonna follow the tape it seems to be still cleared out from the last time I was here. So that means up to the third floor, as long as I go down the same path, the tape bot should be removed. So this is good. This will give us a head start, but then we're gonna have higher floors than we've ever been on before. Elevator, here we go. First floor done. We didn't even encounter a single tape bot because we did good last time, even though we died on the third floor. We did good on the first floor though. Okay, up to the second floor we go. Did I clear the second floor? efficiently in which direction did I go I probably went probably went the office direction yeah this looks like the right way to go oh I think I'm I think this is where I died I didn't go up another elevator though I just went up some stairs and now I'm back at this construction area or did I get to another construction area on the third floor I hear someone in here he might be just someone that I never encountered or like left behind. I feel like I died like right here last time. Oh, here we go. Here's some tape I didn't actually get through. All right. It looks like this is the, yep, yeah, this is the elevator. Did I not make it here? Oh, no, I did. I just came from that path, I guess, because this is broken. All right, let's go back up. Third floor. This is definitely where I died then. This is, even though I haven't really encountered much of a threat in here, this is still really nerve wracking. We've had some scary episodes in this game. The last episode was one of the scariest in the woods. Do you guys remember the woods? That was probably the most horror-esque that Scrap Mechanic has ever been. Oh my goodness. My bag is still here from where I died. What? What was on me? Probably like nothing. I was so new back then. I can't believe that. I can go see where I died. That is like kind of like, it's a little bit morbid. Like, yeah, I, yeah, you do that every single time you die, but this is so long ago. 
And this is like when I actually gave up on trying to go find my body because I just didn't have the resources anymore. This is like my biggest defeat right there. Yep, it's another construction floor. So they could be anywhere here. This is where I got killed. There it is. I see my bag. I remember running out of ammo at that wall and trying to circle around the wall, trying not to die. coming after me. Well, I'll meet him over here. Come at me. Come on. Where are you coming from? There's so many ways he could probably get here. Which way is he going? He sounds so close. That looks like a dead end. This is making me really nervous. He just disappeared. There was no way for him to go over there. He must have fell down the stairs. Okay. I'm at my bag. Was that the one that killed me? If he was the one that killed me, I gotta kind of kill him. Right? I mean, that's how it works. You get revenge. You caused me a lot of hardship, bud. I don't think I can let you get away with it. Watch him kill me again, too. My bag is right here. I don't hear anyone else near me. What did I die with? Oh, look at this. Yeah. Another toilet on my toilet. Yes. <laughs> I got my own, my first toilet back. Oh, we've been through a lot. I'm so glad I found you again. All right, he must be right on the other side of this wall, but there's other angles here, too. So I gotta be really careful. Okay. There he is, there he is, there he is. I can't get... There we go. I couldn't get my potato over that ridge. Alright, there we go. I'm assuming he's the one that killed me, so I'm gonna say... Revenge achieved. I have avenged my own death. Alright, now where am I going? Alright, here's some tape here. So let me go in over here then. Ah, here we go. Elevator. It says elevator. We're already at the elevator. I hear one, though. Is he guarding the elevator for real? No. How is that for a shot, huh? How is that for a shot? Ooh, and there's a chest in here. All right, I'm gonna leave the soil bags. We have now officially passed our first attempt at this warehouse. We're on the third floor. We're moving up to the fourth floor. I have never been to the fourth floor of a warehouse. My last successful warehouse was only three floors. So this is going to be new territory for me. I don't know, like, I, it probably doesn't even make a difference how many floors a warehouse is, but I feel like maybe the loot will be better since you have to go through more levels of tape bots to get to it. At least that's what I'm hoping. So now we are officially in uncharted territory. There could be a bot around any corner. Okay. All right, you got this, scrap man. Is that a tape bot? That's a tape bot. I didn't even see it. He was blending in with all the tape so much. I'm so glad he didn't see me. Why does it sound like there's a tape bot right above me? So if this is the fourth floor, this is a four floor warehouse. That means that the loot is on this level. He sounds so close. He's probably right in that room. I think he's right in this room right here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There is so much noise happening. All right, continuing down the hallway. All right. He's right there. This is going to be a close one. Which way is he facing? All right, ready? He hit me? He hit me? I could not have shot him quicker. I cannot believe these tape bots sometimes. They just, they are really OP. I cannot believe that was a hit right there. All right, well, let's go down here. Take that as a hint that this is the path being protected. 
Oh, look at that. Another one right here. You gonna react as soon as I open this as well? Alright, you ready? Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. You're not gonna get me this time. Oh, here we go. Going up. Alright. Whoa! Oh, that was a red one. That was a red one. I've never been hit by a red one. I don't know how much damage they do. I forgot about the red ones until just now. Okay. The red ones shoot explosive tape, by the way. In case you did not see that episode. I was fortunate to have not been hit by it, but I experienced the explosion right over my shoulder. All right. Oh, he is... Oh, no! Oh, no! What do I do here? Oh, this is bad. This is terrible. I have been in better situations than this one right here. All right, so I think I got to hit it from here. Plenty of potatoes. Plenty of potatoes. Ah. I remember this area from the other warehouse. This is where the very morbid box of sleeping cows. Sleeping cows, yep, that's that's what this is. That was a red one. There's another one over there. Come on. Just, just flip the... <laughs> there was an easier way the whole time. Oh man, I can hear so many more. That's more cows. I think this is where I have to go through there. He got me, he got me, he got me. Okay, hide, hide, hide. Heal. I'm just gonna eat this blueberry. Okay, full up. Alright, I think I'm healed enough to tank another shot. At least by the blue guys, maybe not the red guys. Alright, I think this is where I go in, I go up, and then I think I'll be on the floor with the loot. Alright, here we go. We're on the spiral staircase. Inside the vent. Yeah. Ugh, that, didn't, that wasn't scary at all. This eventually leads us up to the loot room, I hope. So last time, oh my goodness, look at this. Look at this. What am I supposed to do with this? What am I supposed to do with this? Okay, I can do this. Do I protect myself real quick? Any other tape bots that can see this? There we go. There's another one in this room here. Looks like we're all clear. Yeah, I think we're all clear right now. Storage? Utility? Oh, here it is! Here it is! We made it! We made it! Yes. How much room do I have? I have plenty of room for loot. Alright, last time... I got to this room in another warehouse. There were no tape bots inside. I don't know if that's always the case. I hear I hear tape bots, but they could be over in that other pathway. I think we're good. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm just like waiting to get shot at. It looks like we're all good. All right, we made it, guys. We made it. All right, so once again, this room has nothing, but I think... There's a wall. I think you're supposed to, once they actually activate the warehouses as they are intended to with the encryptors, I think it is hidden behind this wall. And you have to use explosives to get to the encryptor behind this wall. That is my understanding based off of the comments that you guys have been sending me. 
But here we go. Into the loot room. Look at that. Full of epic loot. All right, what are we gonna get today? I hope we get some more epic garments. I don't know if that's guaranteed. All right, you know what? Let's just, let's just do everything. Everything! Let's see all the loot on the ground. What do we get to choose from? Ooh, level three seat. Oh, no. I don't see an epic garment. Or unless it's in here. Oh, <gasps> yes! Yes, 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 yes! I don't even really... I mean, I guess I'll take them. All right, we have common, rare, and epic. Did I get that last time? All three of them? All right, we got... Component kits. We got all kinds of stuff. We got suspension. We got gas engine. Oh, oh, that feels good. That feels real good. All right, now I gotta not die. I can still die. If I encounter two tape bots at the same time and they both shoot me at the same time, I die. That's how this works. So I am not safe by any means. So what I want to do is find the elevator up to the roof. And I don't even have room to loot anything from the roof, which is kind of sad. What I'm gonna do then is jump off the roof and try not to die jumping off the roof, but I might die jumping off the roof. But worst case scenario, I can just spawn at my car, which is out there, and then go get my loot. So let's hope I can make it to the roof without dying. In order to make it to the roof, I think I gotta go through this utility direction where there's a blue tape bot right there. He's waiting for me. Oh, he's not facing this way anymore. Okay, hold on. There we go. Going good so far. Going good so far. Utility. I want to see elevator. I want to see the words elevator, please. Okay. Oh, man. There's more to this than I thought. I thought the elevator was going to be nearby. It appears that is not the case. Oh, no! Oh, no! That was almost exactly the wrong situation to be in. One of them got me, but I took out two of them while they were shooting me. Managed to only get hit once. That's a success. Okay. All right, all right, elevator. Yes, 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 elevator. I still don't know if they ever guard the elevators. I've never encountered one after finding an elevator thing. From the elevator sign to the elevator, I have yet to encounter an actual tape bot, but I am not gonna rest easy. So the elevator's behind me, but I'm just curious. Yeah, I don't, I'm not gonna go in there. Let's just go up, just go up to the roof. I think this is the roof. Imagine if they just added a boss to the roof somehow between the last time and this time, and now I'm just like, I think it's going to be totally clear and safe up there, and there's just going to be a boss guy waiting for me. All right, here we are. We're on the roof. Everything looks nice and clear, nice and clean. So I didn't even realize that I could loot this stuff on the roof before. What is this even? This is... Uh, rusted metal blocks? Nah. Nah, we have higher standards than rusted metal. Um, what about these? Well, they have a pretty decent durability, but I think it's only... They don't stack. Yeah, these don't stack, so that is not a very good use. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. That there. Can I... Oh, I can't take that. That's not... Wait, what? Where's that metal coming? Ooh. Ooh, I will take metal. Yes, I will take metal. Man, there's just like this thin layer of metal, though. Like, it doesn't even... There's not even that much of it. All right, well, I think I've gotten everything that I really need from here. I don't know... I don't know where I left my vehicle. I see a couple of dots. Nothing that is indicating my vehicle yet, though. Oh, there it is. There's my vehicle right there. All right, I guess it is in this direction after all. It is right... To Imagine if I could get in the seat from the... From up here. <gasps> How epic would that be? All right, but well, I'm going to try a toilet method either way. All right, my vehicle is like right over here. Can I see it? I see my vehicle! Oh man, is this going to be the most epic jump or the most disappointing jump you've ever seen? All right, well, there goes nothing.
All right, guys. We did it. Now, I just have to find my way back home. If anything eventful happens, as usual, you'll be the first to know. There's a cow rolling down a hill. There's a cow rolling down a hill and a farm bot's going after him. Come here, farm bot. Come here, farm bot. How did that not kill you? There we go. Don't worry, I saved you. I saved you, cow. All right. Continuing on. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. We got a Haybot. Haybot that doesn't even know what to do with my vehicle. He wants to hit the tire, but he's not gonna. No, you're not gonna, are you? Oh, oh no, he's doing it again. He's doing the thing again. No, no, no. Okay, all right, we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> yeah, this vehicle is really nice. It is really, really nice to control, even at these really high bouncy speeds. It does drift a little bit, but uh, it does just fine. All right, how many cows do we have left? Oh, fantastic, none. We went from seven cows to zero cows. All right, so here's what you have to look forward to in the next video. We've got all of these boxes, plus this one, plus this one, plus this one. So that is eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 boxes, and I'm about to save a cow. There we go. All right, and uh, I used about 50 ammo. I went with about 200, and now I've got about 200, or 152, so we didn't really even use that much ammo, which is great. All right, and why don't we end this episode off with a raid, because I need to replenish... Oh, that was way too much. Why did I take so much? I need like six of these. Because uh, I'm going to want to replenish some of my ammo that I've just... Oh, I forgot. This thing broke in the last episode. Hold on. I think I can fix this. Um, I need to be able to put my lift... Here we go. Here we go. Right there. And... Fixed! So now it should work. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, so we're going to end off with a raid. I don't know how big this raid's going to be. Probably not that big. Hopefully my base doesn't completely break like the other video, but I think we're okay now. I think we've settled all of that issue. Wait, why did this, why did this run out of ammo? That never runs out of ammo. Huh, something, something different happened with it today and I don't know why it was different. All right, we have about 45 seconds till the raid happens. I'm gonna do my best to get rid of some of these excess hay bot legs that are just hanging out around here because it seems like the more you have, the laggier the raids are. Here it comes. Let's go ahead and activate the wall and I'll deal with anything coming at me. Oh, it is laggy. Why is it so laggy all the time? All right, anything going on the sides though? They're all coming after me. Wow. All right, um, what if I, here, I'm gonna try something here. What if I do this? Aha! Now what are you gonna do? Come after me, bros. Oh, they're actually like, they're actually hitting it now. Come after me over here, bros. <laughs> there we go. Oh, oh, I hear someone. Oh, no, 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 don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Please don't do it. Why are you doing it? Don't. No. No. No, 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 no. They're just hitting it now. Oh, why does this happen? Why? You were fine for so many nights. Oh, man. Uh, I don't know why. Huh, that is really, really frustrating. Like, I really worked hard on this system and uh, it doesn't want to stay, it doesn't want to stabilize. All right, it's mostly fixed now. Um, I don't know if there's a way I can stabilize this. I don't know what's causing it to destabilize in the first place. Let's see if it, oh. No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. Oh my goodness. Like, everything is attached. Like, this back here. Well, what is... That's glitched, too, right there. This is the piston for the water thing. That's why... That's why I ran out of water. Because this piston isn't working. Look at... That's why I ran out of water. This piston is now glitched. This is supposed to be getting programmed to have this stop shooting water while the uh, pistons are extending. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is so terrible. 
<laughs> Everything is I just broke the thing. No. We may have to think of alternate methods of defense other than crushers, which is unfortunate now that I actually have raids coming. But uh, yeah, this crusher, I mean, it still works. It's just that back piston is no longer attached. So we're going to have to not use this back piston anymore. All right, the water system works again. So yeah, pistons seem a little bit weird sometimes, unfortunately. Um, but we have all of that fixed. I think my crusher will still kind of work. It just doesn't have that back support anymore. And look at that. Look at how much, like, it doesn't even rise. It's too heavy for the pistons right now. All right, this is fine. I kind of wanted to, I, I wanted to redo it anyway, right? <laughs> But next episode, we're gonna have a happy episode because we get to open up garment boxes and just uh, find new things and have some fun and make our character look different. So make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you can get notified of that right away. If you enjoyed this video, you might enjoy some other ones on the channel. So go ahead and check that out on the end screen right here. Hope this video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrabman and I'll see you next time. Bye.